here are three things that Toyota must change in these third gen Tacomas. All right, let's start off with the first thing that I feel Toyota should change on these third gen Tacomas. So I'm pretty sure we've all have seen this truck displayed on our dash every time we start the car or maybe open the door, but check it out. That right there is clearly an SR5. And my truck is not an SR5, my truck's a TRD Sport. So I feel like it'd be pretty cool if Toyota can display your actual trim level in the dash. Like it just doesn't make sense. Like for example, on a TRD Pro, every time you start your TRD Pro, you get a SR5 displayed on your dash. I don't know, that just doesn't make sense for me. But I feel like only the TRD models should have their actual trim level displayed in the dash. I think that'd be really cool. Now, if we wanted to get greedy, it'd be nice if Toyota could actually match the color of your truck and then match it with the truck that's displayed in the dash. I think that'd be really cool. Not gonna lie, if somebody somewhere out there can somehow manage a way to customize that truck that's displayed on the dash to where you can customize and put like a TRD Pro grill or maybe some wheels on there, honestly, I'd pay like a hundred bucks to get somebody to, you know, fix it up for me and make it look like my truck how much would you guys pay for somebody to customize your truck to be displayed on that dash that's what i want to know let me know in the comments now the next thing that i feel toyota should change on these tacomas is the cheap plastic that they have in the interior like this right here i'm pretty sure we can all agree on this but this part of the truck gets super scratched it looks like a chopping board and then you got this plastic part that also gets really scratched up I mean, you can see the fine scratches there. The screen as well. The screen tends to get scratched up a lot. Like, I don't know, I don't know if this is plastic. Oh yeah, it's plastic, it's not glass. But yeah, cheap plastic there, cheap plastic here, and then cheap plastic here. Now, I've tried all sorts of products to cover up these scratches, but nothing seems to work. I do know that they sell a screen protector for your stereo here, but I mean, if you already have a scratch stereo, what's the point of putting a screen protector on there? I mean, the scratches are still there, you know, you're just covering it with the new glass screen, which kind of pointless, I guess. But yeah, I mean, if a Toyota can change all these cheap plastic parts, I mean, they can still be cheap plastic, but not that cheap to the point where it scratches so easily. Uh, that would be very great. And lastly, we have these very cheap cameras that Toyota equips these trucks with. All right. I mean, just look at that. I'm pretty sure we can all agree that the quality is not that great. Yeah, I guess you can see the vehicles around you. You know, that's really all that matters. But I mean, for a $30,000 truck, I mean, the least that they can do is put at least 720p resolution. It literally looks the same as an Android. And just to prove it to you guys, I'm going to compare it right here. The Toyota camera. And that is the Android camera. So... Honestly, I think the Android camera looks better than the Toyota camera. <laughs> That's funny. Now, my truck is only equipped with the reverse camera, but for the newer Tacomas that come with the front camera and then side cameras for when you're off-roading, like that's where I feel like it's more important to have like high resolution quality because I mean that's where you really need it and I've seen a couple of videos on these newer Tacomas where they're showing like the display of the cameras in the front and then the cameras are like on the side of you so you can see what's on the side of you when you're off-roading like it looks really blurry and I feel like that's where you know Toyota really should step up their game and add some better quality cameras you know maybe they should team up with apple and put some really high quality cameras on there which i feel would be really great for the tacoma but before i end the video i want to let you guys know that i opened up a new instagram account so if you guys want to follow that i'll leave it here on the screen that way you guys can check me out and you guys can dm me pictures of your guys' tacomas and i'd be more than happy to put them in the next video so hit that follow button it's free i promise you you won't regret it but until next time gooner tacoma let's end it off on the tacoma wheels